What's up guys, Center Stalker here for a video. This video right up here will be an interesting kind of fun video, something a little bit different. Um, I'll explain right now what it is. Last week in a video, I was actually on Wednesday, I was at the store, I was making a video, and I was looking for that Target exclusive Steelbook, the Rob Zombie collection of movies. It was totally gone, it has um, House of a Thousand Corpses, Devil's Rejects, and Three from Hell. You know, so I was looking for that, all gone, went to like a couple locations. My man Brendan, the day before on Tuesday, the day I should have went, he, had, he, got, he, was, he got lucky enough to find two copies at his local Target. So he bought a couple of them, one for himself and one to buy to give away to a friend or to sell or whatever. And then he got wind of it, he saw my video and he's like, hey Danny, would you like to buy the copy I got? You know, I paid 30 bucks for it, just you know, give me 30 bucks and some shipping, kind of like two bucks or three bucks for shipping and you know, whatever, and you can, I'll give it to you. And I'm like, dude, hell yeah, dude, thanks bro. Okay, I'll buy it. I'm like, are you sure you wanna get that? If you want, you can hold on to it. You can sell on eBay in case the price goes up and that thing, it's gonna be really hard to find. And I was like, you sure you really wanna sell it to me? Is it, I mean, is, I mean, if not, it's okay. He's like, yeah, it's totally cool. I'll give it to you, Danny, it's totally cool, bro. And I'm like, dude, thanks you, man. So gave him the money through PayPal, and he was gonna ship it to me. And then like during that time, he says he's gonna give me a big box, a mystery box of goodness sent my way and I'm like, are you sure you don't have to do that, man? Like, holy crap. And then he's like, I'm gonna send you a nice surprise. It'll be fun unboxing thing. And I'm like, okay. And so, yeah, so he made a video showing it like last night. I got the package, a 10 pound box. I'll show you guys it right now. Let's go unbox it. Let's see what's in there. I'm definitely curious, this should be cool. Thanks, man. You are the man with movie one. Make sure to hit my man up, subscribe. Check out his video, of course, too. Great, great guy. He's a real one. He's awesome. He's like one of my best friends. Really cool guy, awesome dude. And let's go see what he got me. I have no idea, it could be anything in there. Here's the box he sent me. And you can see it is a pretty, pretty big box. And so yeah, here's my hand to it. And this is this has some weight to it. So let's go check this out and see what's inside. Before we do that, I'm a little bit thirsty right now. Let's go to the fridge, grab a drink. But right, the drink I'm gonna grab is something totally different. A little bit different. I saw this other day and I went to, went to uh, get some gas. I went to the liquor store and I saw they had this. So like, you know what? I gotta get this. This is a throwback to back in time for me. I got some good old Fago, buddy. Whoop, whoop. Fago ICP. I said, love it. And saying clown pops back. This is rock and roll. Only a dollar for a 23 ounce of some of this Fago. Let's go to it like that. Let's do it, huh? Let's crack open this Fago. Then I'll crack open this box. Rock and ride. You guys um, had Fago before and all that kind of stuff. I saw this in the store. Like, you know what? I got to do it up like that. Rock and ride. Mmm. Man, that's pretty good. Good old Fago. Not bad. Pretty sweet. I might have went to a few insane clown posse concerts. Had this stuff drenched all over me. Now I get the drink out of the way. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> there you go. Let's open this box up and see what's inside this mystery box. I have no idea. It could be anything in this. Maybe even his chonies can be in this too. I don't even know. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut it open. I get my knife here. I'm gonna, put the, I'm gonna leave the box up here. I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in this, not look, and kind of pull out things and be surprised as you guys. So let's do it up like that right now. Breaking the seal, as they say. Here we go. We got a box, mystery box of goodness. I see some tapes up here for my peripheral vision. I see some tapes. I don't know what kind though. I'll grab a tape right here in the top and see what we got. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, dude, dope. What? I got Curse 2? I don't even have this. I don't have Curse 2. I think I have like, I think I have like the first one and I have part three. I think I have part three. Dude, Curse 3. I mean, Curse 2. That's so dope. Oh my God, dude. Thank you, bro. You know, I love my tapes. It's from Trans World Entertainment right up there. Check that out. I put the knife right here because a flap kept coming up and my sort of my address was on. So I put the knife like this to kind of seal it up a little bit. So the flap doesn't come off. But yeah, dude, this is crazy. Yeah, I mean, dude, Curse 2, that's awesome, bro. I mean, I can't believe you gave that to me. That's so sick. All right, all right, let's go. Um, Let's go right here. Oh, dude, I just seen the cover of this one. What? I got the, dude, I got the first Curse. You know what? I don't have this. I got Curse 3, actually. I don't have, I thought I had the first one, but I don't because I don't recognize this cover. Holy crap, that's awesome. You got Will Wheaton right there. Wasn't that, he was in, a, he was in like uh, Toy Soldiers and there's much like movies. Uh, Will Wheaton, he was around the same time as I remember like him, um, Jonathan Brandis and you know, Sean Astin and all those guys in the 80s and early 90s were doing movies. 
That's so cool, man. And they came these like neat protective cases uh, back there. You have these really cool plastic ones. They're kind of hard to get out. You feel like you, you squeeze it on the bottom and you kind of like go like this and the tape pops out. And look at that, dude. Whoa. Got to smell it. Got to gotta give it a smell. Oh, yeah. Smell that retroness going on. Woo, it smells like a it smells like a tape video store ass crack. Oh, yeah. That's good stuff. If a video store had an ass crack, it would smell like that. And uh, it's not bad. It smells like good cardboard and dust. So I, I don't mind that cardboard dust smell. Dude, that is so dope. And it has like a, it has like the, the store video, video 10. I mean, I think I went to that one with him back in the day, maybe. I don't know, maybe by his area. You put the tape in there like that. Holy crap, bro. Dude, I've been happy just with these two and the still book that I bought. I mean, this is like, what, dude? Wow, this is so cool. All right, here we go. What do we get, what do we get right here? What do we get? Oh, dude, I got Drop Dead Fred, man. I get this on DVD, but I don't have it on videotape. This is such a weird, cool comedy from, the early, from my early 90s of uh, Phoebe Cates and this Australian guy, uh, Rick Mayhall. I think, I think he passed away now, but it's such a neat, weird one as this. To have it on videotape is cool. Sometimes I always like look at the weird trailers they have at the beginning of the, the, beginning of the movies, and this, this is epic. Oh, my God. Dude, I can't believe you give me all this. I cannot believe it. Wow, he's the, he's the man, dude. He's the man. What do we get here? Okay, okay, look at this. The Road to Jericho. The Road is Jericho. What is Is this like a, is like a bad? I've never seen this. I've never seen this before. It's all sealed up, too. This is like a... Um, ba -ba -ba -ba, what is this? This is a... Epic stories and rare matches from Chris Jericho. Okay, so it's like him telling stories, I guess, of his matches of being on the road and then showing like rare matches and that kind of thing right there. That is so cool. The Walls of Jericho, Y2J. It's Chris Jericho, he's, he's in the AEW now, I believe. And um, he's like the guy, he, yeah, he, he, he reinvented himself so many times, it's crazy. And he's still on top, it's nuts. This is, this is sick, I can't wait to check it out. And what do we got up here? No way. I, I saw the top of this, I didn't want to peek, but I saw the top of this. Oh my God, dude, dude. The Peanut Butter Solution. I do have this on videotape, but this copy is way more cleaner. The one I have right here is kind of beat up. This one's like way clean. Look at that thing. It is like super minty clean. Oh my God, bro, bro. Are you sure, bro? You bro, bro. Oh my, that's awesome, dude. It's such a weird movie. The Peanut Butter Solution. It's on blue right now by Synapse Films, but definitely watch. You guys have never seen before. This is such a weird one to watch is if we're going like this, I want to see the inside. This is a weird one to watch is this. So like, it's just the hair grows everywhere. Everywhere the hair grows of this peanut butter solution stuff. Really cr cringy, weird, and creepy. Almost like a nightmare when watching this. Awesome movie. Dude, my man, what movie you won? Peanut butter solution. Hell yeah, bro. Peanut butter solution crew. Ooh, man. Awesome, dude. This is such a cool movie. Dude, oh my God. So I got the flap like I don't see a little bit inside. So let's go in there and see what I get. I'm just gonna grab something. Let's grab, a, I got a, what's this? I think it's a DVD, I thought it was a CD. It's a DVD. What do I get, what do I got in time? I have no idea. You guys see it first. I have, oh, dude, The Price of Fame, The Million Dollar Man. What, I never, this is like, almost like a documentary. Oh, that's so cool. I've never seen this. I heard it was really neat about, um, yeah, Ted DiBiase and stuff like that. and. All kinds of issues he had going on and the stuff of his career and everything like that. Dude, it's like brand new, bro. Oh my God, dude. Yes, the million, everyone has a price for the million dollar man. <laughs> That's my, my my cheesy million dollar man laugh. But holy dude, this is, the box is, I'm not even like halfway done yet. I'm not, I'm not even halfway done. Let's go like this. I got a CD, I got a CD. Oh, oh yeah, I see this. I seen this in the video. He, did the, he posted this video. I saw this thing, the bodyguard soundtrack. For I, I will always love you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I will always love you. Oh, that, that I will always love you. What movie one, man? You are the man, bro. Oh my god, dude. Got the I can I can serenade myself to some bodyguard action right there. Oh yeah, play some bodyguard and take a nice dump in the toilet. I cannot wait. Ooh, man, rocking and Ryan. Here we go. Really like there. Okay, so we go. Come on, let me see. I'm going like this. I just, it's like a bubble wrap, I think, or something. That's on this. Boop. What do we got here? What, what do we got here? The core. 
Oh, Aerodynamic Car, here we go. Oh yeah, the core. You know, I've heard this, I've never seen it before. The core has, um, you know, it's over at Lindo. It's like a sci-fi thing about, like, um, Earth, Earth's inner core is about to combust or something like that. It's like an end of the world kind of thing. So definitely a good one to watch these times. It's continuing. Okay, 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 okay. I see I see the one I, oh, this is the one I bought. This is the one I, this, this is the only thing I was actually requesting for. And I got all of this. I got all this. Dude, Wet Movie One Year is so generous, dude. But check out the steel book. I got the steel book, bro. Oh my God, so cool. The blue rays, the blue rizzles. Only at Target exclusives. There's a spine. I cannot wait to check this out. Um, you know, pretty much, I, I, um, I got these movies. Are pretty much, it's great. The steel book is awesome. Watch it on Blu-ray. Cannot go wrong with that. And I believe it has some features on there. Yeah, some some behind this, some commentaries and stuff like that. But look at that. It's a beautiful looking steel book, though. It's so killer, dude. I got, I can't believe I, I this is what I got. And dude, unbelievable, man. You are the man, dude. Thank man, dude. I can't thank you. And this is crazy. So cool. So cool. So off off to the box of goodness. Here we go. I got one. That's the one I got, and I got all this, dude. You're so generous. Okay, okay. I got. I do have a tape. What is? I have no. What, what is this? Big shots. They stole a Mercedes with a body in the trunk. I have never seen this before. I remember he was showing this in his video. That looks pimp as shit. Look at that. Oh my, Ivan Reitman production. This looks so weird. I've never seen this before. I've never seen this. Check out the back. Right over there, check it out. Who, who are these kids in this movie? I don't even know who they are. Uh, ba, 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 ba. This looks amazingly strange. This looks, this, this looks cool. I'm just, reading, I'm just reading the back of it. So I'm like, that's why it's like that. But Lori Moore home video. Dude, I think, I think me and you, Brennan, I, we have to, I think we have to take a photo like that. Oh, yeah. Dude, I've never seen this before. That is so sick, so rare. Oh, my God. Bro, what do you do, bro? I got another VHS tape. Holy shit. This, oh, Horror Express. This is the one he got at the last blockbuster. Dude, this is so cool. It's like, it has like a seal there, too. See, it's like a seal. It's all sealed up. Previously viewed. From the last blockbuster, when him and uh, buddies, OGP, Fluffy Gamer, they went up there. I wasn't gonna go. I didn't get a chance. I, I was like, but then I, I didn't make it. But I wasn't gonna go up there with them. I should have went up there. My own fault. But hopefully, if you go to the neck of the woods again, but we can go in there and, and uh, you know, I'll make up for it sometime in the future. But yeah, that this is sick, dude. Haley, the Horse Best, great movie. Especially from the last blockbuster, makes it all that much more special. Uh, here we go. Here we go. I got a couple DVDs right here. Dude, we got Hell in the Cell. We got some Malcolm X going on, some Denzel Washington. What do you know about that? Dude, I haven't seen that in forever. I haven't seen it in like in 20 years probably. Hell in the Cell. This is like the best of, what is this? Like the best of Hell in the Cell. Check that out. Undertaker, Brock Lesnar going on. Hell, I got a lot of awesome wrestling stuff to check out. Holy crap. Here we go. Got some CDs. What do we got here? We got the Beastie Boys. Dude, to the Five Burrows. Bro, the Beastie Boys in the, his house? Dude, hell yeah, bro. And we, what is this? Woo, Meth, Ghost, and Ra, the Woo Massacre. The Woo, I've, I've never heard of this. I don't think I've even seen this. The Woo Massacre, Def Jam Records. Dude, I'm down with some hip-hop right there. Some, you know, some meth. Dude, this is sick. That's a Method Man, Ghostface. Hell yeah, dude, this is, this is sick. I can't wait to play these. Oh my God, I got a whole bunch of stuff. Man, this is like nuts. We got a couple tapes up here. Got a couple tapes. Oh yeah, dude, dude, yes, yes. Out of bounds, cool, rare movie. Kind of a really neat, like like thriller one is this. Out of bounds. Star, what's his name? Um, Anthony Michael Hall. You know, he's in. Um, I think he was like uh, Breakfast Club, uh, National Lampoon's Vacation, and stuff like that. Dude, and a low down, dirty shame. Keenan Wayans. Oh, yeah, some of that old, old school back in the day going on right there. Have not seen that for a, such a long time. This is crazy. Oh, my God. I think I'm almost getting done with this. A lot of stuff. Oh, yes, dude, yes. Oh, some good cheese, bro. We got some Double Dragon, dude, on VHS. Such a good, bad movie as this. Look at that. Oh, my God, so good. Robin Patrick, T-1000 with that hair, terrible hairdo. Love it. Love it, dude. Oh, my God. You, you know this has some awesome trailers at the beginning of this tape. Probably some, like, Nintendo, like, you know, or Sega type stuff at the beginning of, like, promotionals. I don't know the trailers of this stuff, but I know it has to have something like that. 
That is epic. Epic, man. Holy crap. Here we go. Here we go. I'm getting down. I, got, I think I got three or four things left. Three or four things. Here we go. Here we got some tape. More, a bunch of tapes. Heart of the Dragon Jackie Chan. I've never heard of it or seen this. I know my man has a, he loves Jackie Chan. Jackie Chan's cool. I've never seen this one. Dude, yes. Okay, here we go. Here we go, another tape here. Here we go, another tape here. Honeymoon till death do us part, dude. Bro, this looks awesome as shit. Look at this cover. Look at that cover. Are you kidding me with that cover? That looks sick and badass. Look at that cover, dude. I have never seen this. Um, I, see, I heard of the movie. I've seen the cover, but I've never seen the movie. Um, this is amazingly cool, man. It still has the old shrink wrap on the tape, too. But, dude, this looks great. What year is this? This is, um, I don't even know what year it is. Probably like early 90s or something like that. But I love that cover. That cover is, that cover is dope. I love it. Holy, dude, Brendan, man. Oh, my God, man. There's a lot of stuff. This is crazy. Okay, I got two things left. Okay, what do we got here? What, what is this? Outlaw Prophecy. Some cheesy Tromaville action. I've never seen this one. This looks amazingly bad and great, though. Look at that. Some Tromaville Outlaw Prophet. That's not a prophecy. Prophet. This looks great and bad. David Hebner. Yeah, David Hebner is a great cheesy, like, uh, late 80s, early 90s, like, action star kind of guy. That's, um, I think that's him right there. But yeah, good stuff. And I think the last thing, this, I think this is the last thing. Here we go, it's tape. Got my VHS, I mean, my VHS library just went up. Here we go, we'll get the last one. What do we got, what do we got? Operation Dumbo Drop, yes. He was showing this in this video and I was like cracking up. And he's like, and then, then now I have it, dude. This is awesome as hell. Ray Liotta, uh, you know, Danny Glover, Dennis Leary. This one I have not seen probably since it came out. I remember renting this at Blockbuster. And then I've never seen it since, like, back when. So this would be great to go back 25 years ago and relive this again. This is awesome. Yeah, that was it. That was, that was, that was all the stuff. This was all the stuff. Dude, Brendan, you got you hooked it up, bro. I got the knife. Put it leave it right over there. Wow, this is a lot of stuff, man. Let me, let me show you guys the floor. It's crazy right now. Brendan, bro, I just was going to buy this off. Yeah, I didn't expect to get all of these amazing movies. Like, look at all this. It just... It's just, dude, Brent, you are, you are the man, dude. Brent, I, I can't thank you enough, man. I'm, I'm very appreciative. And my birthday is coming up in the next month on October 20th. So this is definitely a killer early birthday present. Um, a lot of these ones I've, I don't even have. So this is fantastic. Like, great VHS. You know, I love my VHS. And I cannot believe you're going to part ways with some of these VHS. Like, this is dope cover. Great movies. All cool stuff. Like, this looks amazingly bad. Like, I love that kind of stuff. Like, weird kids movies. Like, you no know, weird stuff like that. Like, this. Little Marines. Kung Fu Kids. I love all that kind of weird stuff. Wrestling. Documentary. Peanut Butter Solution. What? Cool Chris Jericho. Wrestling and documentary kind of stuff. Drop that Fred Hell in the Cell. I got action. I got suspense. I got everything. I got horror. I got all the goodness right up here. Oh, my God. This is, this is like... This is crazy, man. This is absolutely nuts. Wow. That, that was an epic mystery unboxing i've ever seen one this is like i did not expect all of these amazing movies from you man oh my god brandon love you man one of my best friends ever is you 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 rock i didn't expect this at all very appreciative and humble by it oh my god dude i will definitely send you have to send you a box sometime down the line of some just some stuff like a weird mystery of hodgepodgeness and send you something too down the road Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Oh my God, man. So if you guys like this video, I definitely love it. Man, drop that thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you're new to my channel. Man, make sure you definitely hit up my man, What Movie One, subscribe to him too. This is like crazy right here. So cool, so appreciative of it. Dude, it was a good thing I wore my VHS Friday the 13th shirt because I got a lot of VHS. My VHS library just got a little more fuller. Just got a little more fuller. <laughs> I don't mind that one, but no, I do not mind that. Oh my God, this is, this is, uh, this is crazy. I do, I, I definitely appreciate it. So, so cool. I'm like, I'm lost for words. I am actually like, huh? This is happening? Wow, I got, I got a lot of cool stuff to put away in here and to watch. I'm so like pumped. This is crazy cool. Wow, dude. Awesome unboxing video. Definitely loved it. Like I said, I hope you guys did too. 
Whew, and I'll catch you guys later in the next video. This was amazingly cool. I'll see you.